Welcome back, future criminologists. What crime is committed by a person who kills a three days old baby? Again, welcome back, future criminologists. In this video, I will be discussing the crime of infanticide. Infanticide. Infanticide is the killing of any child less than three days old, whether the killer is the parent or grandparent, any relative of the child or a stranger. Therefore, killing by the father, mother, or any of his ascendants of a child less than three days old is infanticide and not parricide. Elements of the crime of infanticide 1. A child was killed. 2. The deceased child was less than 3 days old. Please take note of the word less than. 3. Accused killed the said child. Take note that the child must be born alive and fully developed. That is, it can sustain an independent life. If the child is born dead or if the child is already dead, Infanticide is not committed. Although the child is born alive, if it could not sustain an independent life when it was killed, there is no infanticide. For example, the Supreme Court in the case of People v. Paikana states that even if the child who was expelled prematurely and alive at birth the offense is abortion due to the fact that a fetus with an intrauterine life of 6 months is not viable. What is the effect if the crime was committed to conceal dishonor? Concealment of dishonor is not an exculpatory or exempting circumstance in the crime of infanticide. It merely lowers the penalty to prision mayor if committed by the mother or reflection temporal if committed by the grandparents. Only the mother and maternal grandparents of the child are entitled to the mitigating circumstance of concealing dishonor. However, the mother who claims concealing dishonor must be of good reputation. What is the difference between infanticide and parricide if the offender is a blood relative of the child. As to age of the victim, in infanticide, the age of the victim is less than 3 days old, while in parricide, the victim is at least 3 days old. As to liability in conspiracy, if infanticide is committed in conspiracy with a stranger, both the parent and the conspirator or the stranger are liable for infanticide. In parricide, only the relative concern is liable for parricide. The co-conspirator is liable for murder because of the absence of relationship. As to mitigating circumstance of concealment. In infanticide, concealment of dishonor in killing the child is mitigating, while in parricide, concealment of dishonor in killing the child is not mitigating circumstance. Now we go back to the question, what crime is committed by a person who kills a 3 days old baby? The answer is murder and not infanticide, parricide, or homicide. It is not infanticide because the age of the child when killed is not less than 3 days. It is not parricide because the problem is silent as to what is the relationship of the killer or accused to the victim. It is not homicide because of the presence of qualifying aggravating circumstance of treachery, and thus the crime committed is murder. The Supreme Court in various cases stated that Killing a minor is always treacherous since they have no means to defend themselves. To end, 
Please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more videos.